What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBASafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today we're going to talk about what is, is the Richard Jefferson set actually worth it? So we're going to go over that. We're going to go over a, a little market tips as well. So yeah, let's go over the challenges as per usual. Guys, drop a follow on my Twitter because we hit 300 followers and we hit 100, uh, 50 likes on this video and 80 likes or 100 likes on the other video I posted today. We're going to give away two $10 PSN codes, 20k on Xbox, and another $10 Xbox code. So let's hit those goals. Drop that sub as well. Maybe we can hit 3,500 subs. That'll be lit, man. Let's get into it. So this set a lot to talk about i personally wow vince carter at 150 whoever did that's a bozo so let's talk about this set let's talk about the market coming soon and i have a lot to talk about so first off this set over here we're gonna talk about it we're gonna break it down we're gonna break down the challenges too not this set where is it all right so we got the jason kid spotlight so pretty much every car in the set is worthless besides the hakeem the vince carter and the terry so now we're going to go over the set. I'm going to tell you how much it is and what you should do. So, all right. Let's just say he's a 1,000. Rex Chapman is around a 1,000 as well. Okay. Jim Jackson. I believe I sold mine for around 9-ish K. Let's just say 10K. So, 12K right there. Penny's going to be 1K. He's probably going to be 1K. So, 13K. He's around 1K. 13. Let's just say 14. He's cheap. It's a ruby. Uh, 14 let's just say 20 20k with the rubies uh antonio mcdyes wow he's that cheap 20k uh, another five 25k kenyon martin what is he around 30k 25k i wish it the, the like cheapest just showed up so 25k let's just give it 30k so about 25k plus 30k uh we got 55k then we got the Vince Carter, who's going, honestly, for 120. He's not going for 150. He, I saw a ton for 120. So, 55K plus 120, 175. Now, the Jason Terry is around 40, 30. So, 175. Let's give it 205 plus the Hakeem at around 300. So, what was it? 205 plus 300? No. Don't do it, guys. Do not do it yet. I'm going to tell you why. So, 205k plus 300 is 505k first off half you guys most of you guys don't even have the mt to even come close to doing that so if it's 500k let's just say it's 500 for between 450 to 500k maybe even a little more so let me just break down the set to you so first off if you guys don't know uh these challenges right here not what am i saying these packs are gone on friday so now one method to all you guys don't do these yet okay i'm gonna honestly all right honestly you could do the the basic ones honestly i'm gonna say is it worth it okay first of all i think J evoing jason kidd isn't worth it whatsoever that's what i'm gonna say i think his stats are definitely not good enough to even finish top seven point guard in the game so i would not do it just because first of all evoing cards are so toxic so, in my opinion, the Evo is going to be terrible. Don't do it. Personally, I'm probably going to be doing this set. I still got to do this one and this one, which I'm so far behind. I need to do these to get that Galaxy Oval coming out. So, I'm going to do the Richard Jefferson. I'm probably going to start it up today. Grind a little bit. Um, I am going to do it. I think it's worth it, but is it worth it yet? No, not, not yet. I'm going to tell you why. So, um these challenges i heard weren't too bad that's a dub if you didn't do the Giannis one you got to do that that's the best one in the game so all right let's talk about it so friday we're gonna see oh my god i got hakeem oh no i didn't want to do that shit oh no guys I, I messed up so i just got the hakeem oh boy that is such an l i'm gonna lose so much mt oh boy okay so I just got the Hakeem. I didn't mean to actually. I think I got him for 250. I got him for around 250. So I guess that's dubs. Um, but yeah, right now, what I'm gonna say, um, sell. I mean, don't sell. There's gonna be crazy packs probably dropping Friday. So now I do not think it's worth you guys 
selling i don't think it's worth you guys picking up these cards yet whatsoever i think you guys gotta wait as these packs go down if the market crashes friday there's gonna be these packs all these cards in the packs vince carter will go for under 100k hakeem's gonna go for probably around 200 base so if you take my methods and you listen just please listen to me do not do this set yet you can do the basics get up all the way to like the ninth chat or no like the 13th challenge and then start to do it because bro you have to realize that it's totally not worth losing a hundreds of thousands of mt at all like just don't lose that much mt if you just listen to my methods um friday there's gonna be a giant market crash personally i'm selling mostly everything in my collection like everything in my collection so try to follow my methods on friday then pick up this set for way cheaper not only that if you guys didn't notice the old spotlight set with the Giannis, the kareem one if you didn't notice as the weeks went on that set gary pete was like 180k he dropped to 100k same same it all worthy so if you want to do these sets i never recommend doing it in the first three days i always recommend during a market crash or something like that because bro it's so much better if you just wait a little bit and watch the cards drop so right now sets 500k friday set could be around 300k because the market just simply crashes it just simply crashes no matter what card you have everything just dies everything crashes and there's just a ton of stuff to go over honestly honestly this is what i think terry's gonna go for under 30 hakeem's gonna go for under around 220 230 maybe even 200k he is one of the best center in the game though that's what that's the problem he is one of the best centers in the game vince carter is gonna go for 110 max max minimum minimum i would say 90 90 to 110k max kenny martin is gonna be around 30 20k this guy's gonna be 3k hot rod williams they're all gonna be cheap bro uh jim jackson will drop to like 4k instead of being like 9 10 but yeah we have to realize that this is a prediction my prediction is probably i would say 90 percent correct maybe even 95 percent correct because it's i've been doing it for so long bro i post market videos every day i know what i'm talking about so is it worth doing the richard jefferson set right now no in the future yes like i said start doing it now um let's see so let's go over so first challenges i'm pretty sure you don't need anything expensive honestly buy everything you can i don't care you can buy any card honestly right now you should not lose mt um buy everything besides the carter and the hakeem i would not touch hakeem that is one player i wouldn't touch so you could probably get all the way up to like this one right here so honestly um all these other cards whatever they're not expensive at all you can buy the martin too i just don't want you to buy a key because if you touch a key or vince carter you're going to lose probably around 50 KMT just off the both of them. So try to stay away from them. Um, I actually did get a Hakeem for the low. I actually got him for around 270, 260. And then I just put the contract on him. So I might make a little bit of MT or even I might make like 12. I mean, I, I don't know because I did. Oh, look, see, look, <gasps> bro. We might have just hit the jackpot. So I got mine for around 70 ish. And it looks like he's going for around 320 and I put a diamond contract on him, bro. I think I might have just dubbed out, guys. I think I might have just made like 50 KMT. So if that, if I did do that, dubs in the chat like that ass. Oh my goodness, that's so big. I hope mine goes for 350, bro. That's what I'm hoping for. But honestly, other than that, try my method see if it works friday big market crash i'm probably gonna have three videos new content video market crash video all that good stuff saturday we're gonna do the same thing tomorrow we're gonna have another prepare video for the market crash so stay tuned for that other than that hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know how this stuff goes um the content bro you guys been showing all that support just make sure to drop that sub go follow twitter for the chance at some of those uh codes and stuff and whatnot but yeah man the support unbelievable wait till friday do the set i beg please wait till friday take my methods put it in the back of your head anyways though hope you guys enjoyed second video done for the day i'll catch you guys tomorrow hope you guys have a good one peace